Hi guys, my name is Olivia and I'm a director and a personal trainer of Fluoro Fitness. Let me tell you a little bit about our business, what we do and um, how, how we got started and a little bit about myself as well. Um, so I will start right from the beginning. Once, once, once um, long time ago, um, I was not a fit kid. I was not into any kind of sports, any kind of um, fitness, exercise, team sports, anything like that. I was not a fitnessy or sporty kid back at school. In fact, I tried to get out of um, our um, PE classes and um, um, fitness classes and things like that because I really hated it. And I was a bit of a chubby kid actually. So. And I know that a lot of people assume that, oh, you're a personal trainer, you must have been always into exercise, always into fitness. Well, that wasn't the case for me at all. I hated training and when I started exercising for the first time, the first few weeks, first few months, and to be honest with you, probably first couple of years, it was always a chore for me. I did not enjoy it. I didn't... I, I started doing it because some of my friends started um, getting into fitness and I have to give credit to my mom because she's always been into fitness. Um, she's a doctor, so she always understood the value, the importance of being fit and healthy. So she never really pushed me into getting into any exercise, even though she was always, she was always valuing health and fitness and eating well. But I guess it rubbed off because even though I wasn't doing anything at that time, I, I grew up watching her do that and maybe later on somehow it clicked in. So long story short, how I started is I just wanted to get a little bit more toned and shaped up and we had a park nearby and I started running, um, jogging, well walking, jogging actually. I couldn't even do, if any one of you familiar with Centennial Park, you know it's about four kilometers I think and the first time I started running I couldn't even keep up with my mum <laughs> which was pretty pathetic and I was only about 17 years old at that time I but I kept kept at it because um, my mum took me along with her and the first time I managed to run the 4k the entire Centennial Park I remember the feeling it was so exciting that I it's like wow I couldn't do that at the beginning and now I can that's awesome. And then I started seeing some physical changes and that's what started motivating me and that's what got me, got me going. But um, again, like I said, for the next couple of years, it wasn't exactly something I enjoyed doing. I just knew that I needed to exercise about three times a week as recommended. I started going to the gym a little bit, had absolutely no idea what I was doing. I looked like an absolute idiot at the gym. It's actually funny because I thought the Stairmaster at the gym was like something that you only do 10 repetitions of because it's like a weights machine and you're training your legs. I didn't realize it was just a cardio machine and you need to just go for at least five, 10 minutes on it. I was just counting one, two, three, four, five. Anyway, so that was about 20 years ago. We're gonna skip right ahead and uh, I'm going to tell you now, I cannot imagine my life without fitness. I do not want, I'm 36 years old now and I do not want to go back to being how I was at the age of 22. A lot of people say, oh, I wish I was in my 20s again. I don't because I was unfit, I was unhealthy. Now I'm 36 and I've never been so fit and it's just, it's not just physical changes. It's, it's amazing you realize how stronger and fitter and healthier you become and everything that you do in your everyday activities in your chores it just becomes you're so much more efficient with everything that you do which is really important because we're so busy these days we have so many things to get done that it's important that we're efficient and we're not exhausted just from you know doing a bit of shopping and doing a bit of cleaning we want to keep going and getting things done and I feel like now, the, the older I get, the fitter I actually get, the, the better I get. So the reason why I'm telling you this is because don't write yourself off and say, oh, I'm in my 40s now, whatever, it's, oh, you know, I can never be like I was in my 20s. No, you can be better than you were in your 20s. It's all about 
consistency is the key and learning how to learning a healthy lifestyle gradually one bit at a time you don't need to completely change everything in one go you just need to slowly introduce healthier habits eating changing my eating habits was a huge thing um, and um, yeah just having that core stability and core strength it's I feel when I walk I feel taller I feel stronger I feel more confident it's it's amazing what fitness can do for you I, I never thought when I started that I would get all these benefits from fitness other than just having a smaller waistline there's so much more to being fit and healthy the, the reason why I'm telling you this is that I started from knowing absolutely nothing about fitness being lazy unfit eating rubbish to where I am now where being fit and healthy is just part of my daily routine and I don't even consider it a chore I look forward to doing exercise and getting out there and going for a run and things like that so I guess one thing led to another I realized how passionate I am about fitness and I started uh, over 10 years ago now training some of my friends and I just took them along with me to the gym because um, I started learning how to do exercises properly just by learning it for myself and then I started ask, asking my friends to come along with me and that's where I realized how much I actually enjoy helping people and them start start to see results which at the time I didn't even think about them getting results I just wanted to help them exercise but then when they started losing weight and they went wow Liv, it, like oh I, I actually lost some weight and I feel great thanks for helping me out and I was like hang on a second this is my calling this is what I'm supposed to be doing so um, and at that point I started doing my studies and a lot of research doing a lot of courses doing personal training course of course and good fitness exercises pre and postnatal fitness because I wanted to be able to help the mums out there as well during their pregnancy as we most of us educated people already know that it exercising during pregnancy is actually quite important for the health of you and your baby and also helping mums to get back in shape after they've um, had the kids so because that's a very big deal and it's really really hard once I've completed the initial um, qualifications as a personal trainer then I slowly started training more people and initially I started training them for free or uh, coming along with other very very experienced personal trainers to group fitness um, training sessions and things like that just to watch and learn from them because I didn't believe on jumping in straight away and training somebody for money until I was really confident and I knew what I was doing not just in training myself but training very very different other people because everyone is so different some people have knee issues and back issues some people need rehab type training some people have a lot of weight to lose some people need to build up muscles sorry guys and I happen to be videotaping right in the plane path so I have to stop and start every time a plane goes above me right above me I had to pick a spot but we're in a beautiful um, Haberfield the Bay Run I'm so happy that I have the opportunity to actually train people here and um, train myself here um, anyway so um, I'm gonna jump right into how fluoro fitness business came about and how it started so we've established fluoro fitness for personal training and group exercises in 2013 and uh, I'm gonna get a little bit closer to the camera now because it's getting windy so you, hopefully you can still hear me well and um, so we've decided to um, team up with one of my partners and we started doing boot camps so we realized that people were really enjoying it because we were creating new and different routines every time now we've got a small team for the time being but a great team we've got our trainers that are running our group training sessions and um, and it's just it's been an amazing journey ever since because I've been doing myself and, and the trainers that work with me we've been doing something that we're really passionate about and that we really love and just the ability to help people to get results like for example when some of my clients I don't even ask them for it and they send me 
a photo of them that they went to a wedding they were a bridesmaid or something like that or they had a wedding themselves and they send me pictures of their wedding and say hey Liv thanks for helping us out we just feel so great and confident it's just such a heartwarming feeling it's hard to describe because you think you guys have done it yourself because you've put all the effort in yourself I, I, if you weren't committed to it I wouldn't be able to achieve much but being a part of this and being able to teach you and show you how to get there it's such an amazing feeling being a part of your success story so it's um yeah and and that's why I always choose to work with trainers who are experienced and who who are also very passionate about what they're doing yeah so that's that's my story of fitness and how I got into it and I really hope that I can motivate and educate as many people as possible in Sydney and maybe one day even abroad um, as I possibly can because it's there's no feeling better than seeing someone actually achieving their goals and feeling amazing and and being able to get to that point where I am myself because I know how it feels to be fit and to be healthy and to feel great as you're going heading towards your 40s especially or, or for some people even more um, it's never too early it's never too late to start I say you just got to start somewhere and the good thing about getting a personal trainer this is it's the time when you really don't know where to start you can't get motivated you're sort of like oh should I do yoga should I do this should I do that and then you just end up procrastinating and this is the time when you really need somebody to give you that little push to just guide you and show you get you started get you going and that's why it's good to have someone who knows what they're doing who is experienced and um, and has gone through it themselves to help you to to get you going get you started and then you can once you get that ball rolling you can do a lot of things on your own and you can yeah you'll feel a lot more motivated and you'll feel um, like you're actually you know what you're doing rather than just reading something or watching someone at the gym doing something and um, about our business the great thing is what what I love and what our clients love most importantly is that we do it outdoors most of the time and we're mobile so we come to you and we make it we, we cut out all that travel time and getting ready for the gym time we can come to your house with all our equipment and all our enthusiasm and knowledge and customize training programs especially for you to really target those areas that you want to target to get you started from where you're at at the moment so if you've done absolutely nothing exercise wise before and you've never had a personal trainer before we will start you right from zero and we will build you up and help you and teach you and make exercise and fitness a part of your life an enjoyable part of your life rather than just pushing you and doing these crazy workout routines and you know throwing you into the deep end just because we do that with everybody that's why we're, it's very important for us to customize a program specifically for you and we will also help you with nutrition because it's huge it's really really important that your nutrition is in line with your exercise otherwise you won't be able to get your results so if you're at a point where you're stuck in a rut you're struggling to lose weight or, or gain some muscles you're struggling to find ways to tone up and to look and feel the way you really want to look and feel and the way you believe that you can but you just don't know where to start give us a call um, for a free consultation no obligation we'll meet up we'll have a chat we'll give you a bit of guidance and uh, tell you exactly what we recommend for you to do and um, then you can decide whether you want to continue on or not so our number is 0410 and we're looking forward to meeting you hopefully very very soon and looking forward to helping you with your fitness and health journey and reaching your goal